Hi everyone, I hope you're really well. I haven't been very active on YouTube lately just because I've been busy and I haven't really had time to sit and like go through things and make videos. So uh, whilst I've got a bit of time, I just thought I would go through the Lush Fresh and Flowers subscription box, which I've just received in the post. Um, I have opened it, but I, I put the sticker back on it um, just to open it for everybody on here. Um, but it, it came like this. So I was a bit like, oh no, there's something broken in it. So I had to check and look, but luckily nothing's broken in it. So yeah, I'll um, start opening. Okay, so let's open it up. This is the bonfire box and got some nice rosehip flowers. I actually thought they were berries. I'm guessing they're some sort of berry, but I'm not too sure. Um, just pop these in water and it says that they can be dried out um, and put on a Christmas wreath. Oh, look, <laughs> got some more coming off. We've got loads of little bobbles in the box as well, but that's the first one anyway. Second up, we've got the Volcano Foot Mask. Um, this, oh, this isn't an exclusive to this box. I have had this before, um, but it's really cooling on the feet and it just really soothes them. It's really nice as well. Um, this is full size and there's the ingredients there. So that's pretty, that's pretty boring one, I guess, for the box, but I don't mind a good foot mask, so I'm happy with that. Next is a mini version of the turmeric roll. It's a cleanser, so you basically you take a pinch off of the end, pop it in the palm of your hand, and then you mix it with water, and it kind of like turns into a paste, and you rub it on your face. Uh, this one, it smells really, really good as well. Uh, it's quite like a spicy-ish kind of scent. It, it's really nice. I like this one anyway, and I've had this before as well, but I just really like the design. I like the little bit of gold on top as well. Next one, which I'm quite intrigued by, um, is the Turmeric Fresh Face Mask, an invigorating astringent, I can't pronounce that word, mask to tone and stimulate the skin using turmeric, orange juice and ginger. You can really, really smell the orange juice in that. It smells really nice. I can't wait to use that either because uh, apparently turmeric is really good for the face as well. So I'll probably use this tonight to be honest. <laughs> I'm gonna move all these little leaves out. It's just like dried up leaves. Uh, you could pop it in your bath, I guess, but I don't think I'll be putting leaves in my bath, but it's a cool like effect for the bonfire box as such. Oh, right, I've got loads of little bobbles as well, like I said. Um, this one is a muslin spice bag. It says it's, um, you have to place the muslin wrap into the bath water, a stimulating bundle for a warming bath with, oh, it's got popping candy in it as well. Oh yeah, you can see it all there. So that would be quite cool to use. I think that'll smell really Christmassy as well when it's in the bath. It just smells a little bit, woody at the minute to me but i think when that gets in the bath that'll be really really gorgeous this next one um i'm not very good at pronouncing but it's a hotty massage bar basically but they call it an enflorage which is i think they're basically they're based in the fresh and flower shop in france um so i'm really sorry if i'm saying that wrong um but it's really really melty and you rub it onto your skin and I can't really smell it. It smells like an old shop, actually, that I used to go to. It smells like incense sticks, I think. But I can't wait to use this one either. I haven't actually ever used a massage roll before. So it'll be interesting to see, but I can imagine as soon as I pop it into my hands, it's just going to melt. <laughs> so I'm going to have to be quick with this one as well. This is the last product in the box. It is, oh, it's got loads of little bits of leaves on it. It's the roasting chestnut soap. Um, if you had any Lush shower gels last year, it is the same scent as the roasting chestnuts shower gel that was out for Christmas. Oh, it's quite, ugh. 
Um, it's really cinnamony scented and it's really, really nice. Um, oh, look at my hands. Oh, but yeah, I can't wait to use that one either. I keep saying that. I can't wait to use it. I can't wait to use it, but I really can't. Um, overall, I actually am quite impressed with this box. I actually really like it. It's a really good theme uh, for Bonfire. It's definitely like a warming box as such. Um, with all the, like, the leaves and stuff as well. I'm going to pop these in some water and I'm going to go and get something to eat actually. So, um, thank you for watching anyway if you have. Uh, sorry it's not like my normal one but I just thought I haven't done a proper video in a while now um, so I just thought I'd pop on with all this and show you uh, so I hope you enjoyed watching it from this angle um, let me know in the comments if you like something or whatever and I can explain it a bit more to you um, ingredients wise and hopefully give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel I would be really grateful I am still active on here um, but I just need to take a bit of time out and have, take time to do videos um, in the future so I hope everybody's really well and I'll catch you all soon bye